As you work complex deals, you'll most likely be working with individuals that sit across many different teams, geographies, and project groups. Organizing these groupings makes it easy to understand how those individuals relate to each other, which is critical to winning the deal, especially when managers and other team members are viewing these account maps. To create groupings, click on the gear icon in the top left corner labeled Shapes. Find the Flowchart Shapes library and ensure the checkbox is marked. If not, check the box and then click Use Selected Shapes. Scroll down on the left side of the canvas past your Salesforce contacts until you see a shape library called Containers. Here you'll find a selection of containers that you can drag and drop onto the canvas. For example, let's say I want to show the marketing team a prospective customer. I'll drag a container onto the canvas and then add my contacts that I want to reside in that grouping. Keep in mind that by default, everyone within the container will follow when you move the container. If you want to move the container without moving everything inside, just click on the magnet icon on the right side of the properties bar. This will toggle the magnetic element of the container. As a tip, there are lots of different things you can do with these containers. We recommend adding text boxes to each container to label the group. You can find text boxes in the shape library called Standard. Drag and drop a text box anywhere on the canvas, edit the text, and you're good to go. Color coding these containers can also help you visually distinguish groups from one another and gain better understanding of the deal. Click on the container, select the paint can in the properties bar, and select the color you'd like to fill the container. And there you go! Now you're ready to attack this deal and close the sale. But this is just scratching the surface. There are plenty of other features that can help you get the most out of your account maps. Check out our other Lucidchart tutorials to learn more or subscribe to the channel.